Hello, my name is Alyssa Mitchell, and today I am going to introduce you to the organizational platform called Evernote. Now, Evernote is a really cool platform that allows you to basically organize your life and keep it all in one place. If you're anything like me, I love creating to-do lists. I create to-do lists at work. I create to-do lists at home. I create to-do lists when I'm walking to the grocery store. And as a result, my to-do lists are all over the place and sometimes I don't know what I even need to do. Now, here's where Evernote comes in handy. The Evernote platform actually works on any device. They have a phone application, they have a desktop application, and they even have a web page, allowing you to access your information wherever you are. Evernote allows you to create to-do lists, reminders, calendars, even add screenshots and pictures from web pages or your own personal documents. So today I'm going to show you how I organize my Evernote. Over here I have three sections, grad school, personal, and work. Today I will show you my grad school page. So currently I am focusing on a final project. So one thing I like to add are my little checklist items. So I say prepare for my discussion posts, research web hosting sites, now this is what I really like and think is cool. On Evernote, you can actually add links to specific sites. So if I'm doing research and I run out of time, I can qu quickly save the link to look at at a later time. Another thing I really like is you can download an Evernote widget that allows you to take screen captures on any pages. So here I was comparing different website builders and I took a comparison, scar uh, comparison chart screenshot what I did was I blanked out any web pages I wasn't interested in, and then I was able to highlight features of web pages that I was interested in to compare them. This is a really cool tool, and you know, sometimes you start a task and you don't always have time to finish it. So I really like that Evernote allows you to put your to-do list as work in progress and add to them. Now on Evernote, I also share some personal to-do lists. And for me, one thing I really love is finding new recipes online. What I can do is find a recipe I like online and literally select it with the Evernote widget and it will save it on here. So later when I'm in the kitchen and I'm on my phone, I can just quickly pull up the app and find the recipe. One more thing I really like is all of their pre-made templates. So for example, I am trying to get better about cooking and planning my meals. So they actually have different meal planning templates, food tracking templates that you can use. So here's one for the week of March, tw March 20, oh, 20th. And on this one, I'm able to plan all of my different meals for the week and write them down. And later when I go to the grocery store, I can just open up my phone and access all of the food lists or anything like that. Overall, I think it's a really useful application and I will definitely continue using it.